Hello everybody. Taylor's Ark here. This is my 55 gallon pink convict cichlid tank. I got about six convicts here. They real skittish, so excuse them being camera shy. But yeah, so um just want to show you what I got. All of them hang behind the rock here. I do have this is probably I would say maybe the first week. No, it's not it's about two weeks that I had them so far. And they've already nested. Doing what convicts do best. Already done laid eggs. Let's show you, see if I can get some film. This is mama right here. And these are the babies. They're wiggling now. So there they are. And here comes dad. Coming to see what's going on. See him? There he is. Here's a pair right here. So check these guys out. Yeah. So yeah, you know, I just wanted to show you guys my uh, pink convict sickly tank. I want this female right here to breed because you see how dark and red she is. She's more... With the other two females, she's more dark reddish color. And I love that about her. And I wanna breed her to see if I can get her bred with some with this male here, but he decided to pair up with her. And the weird thing also, I don't know what happened to the eggs, but anybody out there that knows about South American cichlids is that they usually pair up. Let me step back so I can get them to kind of come out a little bit. They usually pair up. But that main dominant male laid eggs with another female behind this rock. Behind that rock here. But the eggs have disappeared. I don't know what happened to them. I don't know if they ate them or what. But as you see, they're very, very skittish. Very skittish. So, um... Yeah, I don't know, but it's weird because he paired up with both of them and all the other ones were hiding back here. What I plan on doing in the future is keeping the tanks only with the pairs. See if I can do that because I'm going to have to reseal this tank. You see this silicone peeling right here and in the back as well too. It's time for this tank to get some maintenance done. I need to get vacuum pretty good, you know. But um, you know, I'm trying to get these guys to listen, like calm down a little bit more. See if I can get these guys to calm down, you know, just a little bit more. But uh, have some pair. And plus, I'm not gonna really do too much with those fry. I'm gonna let nature kind of take its course with those fry back there. But um, yeah, just kind of see what happens with it. But in the future, I do want to see that female right there. I do want to get more females like her. So, yeah. Yep. So, anyways, yeah, this is um, my convict, my 55-gallon pink convict cichlid tank. So, just want to, you know, let you guys know and see what I got going. I will see you in the next one. Leave a comment. Tell me what you think. Maybe if anybody out there else has experienced, uh, because I did not know that the males can share females. I don't. I don't know. I knew in Africans they do that, but not the American cichlids. I thought American cichlids usually pair up, but I guess not. So these are my pink convicts. This is them. So yeah, I'll see y'all in the next one.